Light, light is a wave. Is a wave. But, light but light also, also contains particles. In the, in the 18th, 18th century, we'd already shown, shown that light can act like a wave. wave. He we notice that, that light reflects, refracts, and diffracts. That part, that part was relatively easy. But then, but then Albert, Albert Einstein noticed a situation where light behaved like a particle. This, this was his photoelectric effects experiment. experiment. It involved shining light onto some metal and noticing that electrons were attracted. Today, Today we're going to talk about, about the details of that experiment and what it told Einstein about light. Here are the steps Einstein had to take in his experiment. Step, Step one. Create, create a circuit, circuit that, that contains two large, large parallel plates that aren't touching. Step, Step two. Connect a voltmeter and ammeter to the circuit. The values, the values on the voltmeter and ammeter should read zero initially. Step, Step three. Shine, shine monochromatic or single wavelength, single, single color, color light on one, one of the metal plates. plates. Step, Step four. four watch the spark jump across the spark gap between, between the plates, completing the circuit. Step five. Measure, measure the current and voltage, voltage that now exists in the circuit. Step, Step 6. Try the experiment, experiment with different colors and intensities of light and note down your results. In completing his experiment, Einstein found that electrons were ejected. Brighter light caused more electrons to be ejected, but it didn't cause those electrons to move any faster. But when he increased the energy of the light by using bluer light, the ejected, the ejected electrons, electrons were faster. This, this was a big surprise to him, and these, and these observations ultimately led him to conclude that light behaves as both a particle and a wave. This is, this is called wave-particle wave duality. The idea, the idea is that, is that light contains photons, which are, which are discrete packets or particles of energy. The electrons, the electrons in the metal were being hit by the light's photons, giving, giving them the energy they needed to escape. Blue, Blue light photons contain more energy, so this, so this caused, caused the escaping electrons to move faster, but the, but the brighter light, light simply contained a larger number of photons, so more, so more collisions, collisions happened and, and more electrons escaped. Those, Those electrons didn't have any extra energy, energy. they were they just more numerous. numerous. It is it only possible to explain these observations if light is a particle, and, and so wave-particle wave duality wave was born. Reflection, refraction, and diffraction phenomena can only be explained if light is a wave. But Einstein's photoelectric effect experiment showed that light can also act like a particle. Einstein's photoelectric effect experiment involved shining light onto some metal and noticing that electrons were ejected. Brighter light caused more electrons to be ejected, but it didn't cause those electrons to move any faster. When he increased the energy of the light by using bluer light, the ejected electrons were faster. This, this was, was a big surprise, surprise. and these, and these observations led him to conclude that the light behaves both as a particle and as a wave. This is, this is called wave-particle wave duality.